What's up guys, Brandon from Ross Lanka here. So today we have a humongous surprise. Um, I'm gonna talk about it for a second. So uh, this surprise um, is kind of completing my dream team as good far as lawn equipment goes. Um, this is kind of the somewhat setup I've been wanting for basically ever. Kind of already, I've always dreamed about running these two machines side by side. Um, if you guys haven't already guessed, it's a mower. Um, so, very happy getting into bigger yards this season. This is the one of the bigger reasons I bought this mower. Um, so, without further ado, let's see what I got. So here we have the Quick Cat 36. This is my first stand on mower. Um, it's been an awesome mower, and I um, can't wait to run it side by side with the new one. Um, you know, it served me well. It has a hundred and it has 157 hours on on the dot, actually. Uh, I will keep this mower because we still have yards with back gates. But what you guys are here for is not to see this one. You guys are here to see the new Quick Cat 61-inch mower. Guys, I pulled the trigger on a new 61-inch stander. I'll be running these two mowers this season. Um, so let's do a little bit of walk around for it, starting with the control panel. So, um, control panel, some uh, nicer things they put on this mower is they gave us the gas gauge, which I love. Um, they put dampeners in the controls, which I can actually feel when you accelerate more. It's not as just jerky as that one. Um, without the dampeners, this one is just uh, a smooth ride, which I like. Um, also, looking at it, they have lengthened this. It's kind of easier when you're kind of going fast, but you can do it faster. You need to move the mower in the garage real quick. It was getting kind of cold. So um, they upgraded all that stuff. Um, just has your standard hour meter on it. So going into the pad here, it's just a nice remover mold. Your owner's manual is right here. Tell them to do the machine. Um, here's your hydro pump. Here's your fuel tank. One thing I really do like about the stand, this the new 4000 series is the battery is not exposed like the older ones were. So I think it's gonna be better for the battery. Uh, this is easy accessible, um, easy to access um, and maintain your mower. Also, I about that guys, my garage door just open. Um, so where I leave off at? So we're looking at the fuel tank. So the fuel tank is about five, seven gallons. I'm not really sure how much I'll hold yet. Don't quote me on that. If you guys know, leave it down in the comments. Um, so, um, but that's, again, the fuel gauge is gonna be really helpful determining whether you know how much fuel you have um so we're going on the engine the engine is a kawasaki um seven excuse me fx 730 uh, v um i think it's a lot of horsepower it has upper 20 horsepower i'm not really sure how much again don't quote me on it uh if you guys know again leave it down in the comments but uh this thing is very powerful it has a top speed of 10 and a half miles an hour it can mow an acre flat acre in about 13 and a half minutes so um have that going on in the deck here um another thing i do like about this mower is um you know it, it the your grass flap is stiff on here so you don't have to have a bungee cord running from your mower here um you know you can just put it down as you see you need to get it into a trailer put it up also with this deck you have the it, they already put a bagger mount on it so i can put an accelerator bagger on here Sorry guys, the bus came through. So, um, moving on from the engine, um, I do love how they have the bump stops here. So, um, you're not grinding the deck as easy. Um, I haven't really actually done that to my 36, so I'm kind of happy about, but you do still, just, excuse me, do still see some marks and indentation and stuff like that. Um, so, over here we have the no flat cast, no flat tires, which I love. These casters are pretty thick. Um, and the thing that I love most about this mower is it's made in the USA. These mowers made about an hour away from me in Wisconsin. So I uh, gotta love that. Um, so this is the new 61 inch quick cat. I'm trying to think if there's anything else. So, um, this was actually a demo unit. Um, I bought for my distributor through my dealer. Um, I bought it. I got it last night. It has actually, it only has. 25 28 hours so this thing's practically brand new um i got a great deal on it that's why i went ahead and picked it up this early um so 
Hey right, guys, so some things we'll be getting for it here is the eco plate. Um, I don't think I'll be getting a bagger for it just because the bigger yards we're going for this year won't be bagged. Um, so, yeah, guys, this is the new mower, and here's the new lawn care setup for 2020. So that's it for today, guys. Thanks, guys, so much for watching. Uh, very excited about the new mower. If you guys haven't already, go like, comment, subscribe um, on this video. Go hit that subscribe Go hit that subscribe button on the channel. I can't seem to talk today. Um, also, if you haven't already, go follow us on Instagram, ross.lawn.care. A lot more content of the new mower here and the other Bobcat and everything. So if you guys would do me a favor and go do that, that would be awesome. So thanks, guys, so much, and uh, take care.